Okay, so in this video we are going to talk about Chorus Connections riser charts. So to get started, I'm going to go over to Manage Riser Charts. I'm going to hit New, and I'm going to create a riser chart for our summer show. Now I know that there are about 40 people singing in this concert, so I'm going to put them in four rows of 10. Up here, you can see the blank riser chart. Down here, you can see the list of everyone who's singing in this concert, including their name, their height, the color is what section they're in, and the arrow uh, is their divisi. So Kimberly, for example, you can see that up arrow there, she's an alto one, whereas Caroline with that down arrow is an alto two. And all of the singers in the concert are organized by section and height, so that makes it really, really easy to get started. And if I fast forward a few minutes, you can see that regardless of whether you clump your sections together or distribute them evenly throughout the choir, it's easy to use color, the arrows, and height to make sure that your choir will not only look balanced but will sound balanced as well. And if you ever forget who someone is or just want to see what the choir will look like when everyone's up on the risers, you can switch into picture mode and see everyone's beautiful smiling faces. And that is a quick overview of riser charts and chorus connection. Thanks for watching.